Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh My name is Nur Aida Natasha binti Ismail Metric number 182160 Today our group uh, we going to present our progress on our project which is Automated Air Humidity Control in the Greenhouse For our working design This is the flow chart on how the automated air humidity control in the greenhouse operates the LCD will start to display the command right after the system is on. After some delay, the HD11 which consists of temperature sensor and humidity sensor will start to sense current temperature and current humidity in the greenhouse. Decision making need to be done by the HD11. Either the temperature is low and humidity high or temperature high and humidity low. How the decision making is done by DHT11 refers to the graph of relative humi humidity with respect to air temperature. When the temperature is low, the relative humidity will be high. Thus, when the temperature is high, the relative humidity will be low. Back to the flowchart. Once the temperature and the humidity are obtained, the readings will be displayed on the LCD. If the temperature is high and the relative humidity is low, the speed of the fan will increase to decrease the current temperature and more water will be sprayed to increase the humidity. If the temperature is low and the relative humidity is high, the speed of the fan will decrease to increase the current temperature and less water will be sprayed to decrease the humidity. The DHT11 will then sense the corrected temperature and humidity of the greenhouse and will be displayed again on the LCD. For coding, the first one is Arduino reference for automated air humidity control in the greenhouse. First, we include liquid crystal library which refers to liquid crystal LCD and DHT library which refers to DHT11 and then we define which pin need to be connected by DHT and liquid crystal LCD to the Arduino and then the minimum temperature is declared to be 27 degrees Celsius maximum temperature 32 degrees Celsius minimum humidity 70% and maximum humidity 80% Next is Arduino setup for automated air humidity control in the greenhouse. The DHT is determined to be the input and while the fan and spray is determined to be the output. And then the LCD will start to display greenhouse monitoring. For the Arduino coding where the sensors start to detect the temperature and humidity which will next be displayed in the LCD. Here, humidity is equal to DHT rate humidity and temperature is equal to rate temperature where the humidity and temperature is obtained. And then, the current humidity and current temperature will be displayed on the LCD. Assalamualaikum and a very good morning a bit to my dear friends. So, my name is Muhammad Zabidin B. Muhammad and I'm Matrix number is Y2304. So I want to present about our uh, program coding for our experiments for our project which is automated air with air temperature control system. So first of all we need the uh, coding. So so first we need to uh, uh, to write and hashtag include liquid crystal dot h and hashtag include dht. So liquid crystal it represents the LCD to show the temperature to display the temperature or humidity and what the action should be taken and then uh, as they include DHT is for the sensor so in this case in our project we use uh, DHT 11 to uh, to detect the temperature and humidity so after that we have to define the DHT pin so that it can give uh, a supply to the 
uh, the sensor and uh, and then we have to define the fan the fan and the spray which is fan is uh, taking action and the spray is spreading out the water and then we have to uh, integer humidity because humidity and temperature is in a number and temperature minimum 27 temperature max 32 humidity, humidity minimum 70 humidity max 80 fan speed spray volume fan lcd so uh, we doing a void setup we set up uh, recording with uh, LCD BD. Uh, we declare the uh, pin mode LCD, uh, and then we are doing a void loop. Uh, so for humidity, the DHT read humidity and temperature DHT read temperature. We display into the LCD, and so let's go to the condition said that if temperature is less than 27 and humidity is greater than 80 the action should be taken is the span should be zero which means the span the fan cannot cannot be uh, moved than 80 the action should be taken is the span should be zero which means the span the fan cannot can be uh, moved and the spray volume is equal to 100 then uh, we have to uh, uh, doing something with the LCD it will display the temperature uh, increase or humidity decrease fan turn off spray turn off or something else So the next condition is if temperature is greater than 32 and humidity is less than 50, so the fan speed is uh, equal to 4, which means the fan uh, keep moving, and the spray volume is equal to 500. It will spread up the water uh, inside the greenhouse, and it will display temperature decrease or humidity increase or whatsoever. Fan turns on spray turn on and it will display into the LCD so the third condition is the temperature is greater or equal to 37 between the temperature uh, is less than 32 which means in the range of 37 to 32 uh, we can say that uh, this is an N uh, N is humidity is between the range of 70 and 80 so what should the taken action should be uh, the fan will be at speed of 2 which means uh, the fan still keep moving but in the low speed and uh, we can say that the spray volume uh, uh, continue to spray but in a very uh, little water contain so then it will uh, display the into LCD which is uh, temperature maintain or humidity maintain where fans on sprays on and something like that so uh, we have to put uh, every single condition we have to put a delay to make the operation go smoothly so that's all from me uh, thank you hi my name is Izati Filza metric number 182071 and now I will talk about the circuit simulation circuit design okay for the first of all we need to install the library for sensor DHT T11 which is used for uh, sense, uh, sensor for humidity and temperature the value above is the humidity while the value below is the temperature ok and also the Arduino Uno 
Okay, after installing the library, so we can uh, design the circuit as shown. Okay, for the for the simulation, we have three conditions. So for the first condition is when the temperature is less than twenty seven and humidity is more than eighty, fans and spray will turn off. Okay, so if we set here, the humidity is um, 85 um, and the uh, temperature is 25 okay, so when we run It is shown that the uh, fan and spray is turned off. So uh, before I forgot, uh, actually we uh, define as uh, the motor as the fan, motor as the fan and LED as the water sprinkler. Okay, for the second condition is when the temperature is more than thirty two and humidity is less than fifty. So we set the temperature first as thirty five. and humidity S45 ok the uh, fence and spray will turn on So, it's shown that the LED is turned on and also the spray is turned on. Okay, for the final condition is when the temperature is within 27 and 32 and also humidity within 70 and 80. So, fans and spray will on. So, uh, we set the uh, temperature humidity first as 75. And the temperature, humidity is 75, temperature is 30. So when we run, so both uh, fans and spray will turn on. So that's all from me. Thank you.